Welcome back, it's to Metrofile on Channels Television. Now come with us to Abakeleke, the Ebony State Capital, for the birthday of the governor, Engineer David Umahi. Enjoy. <laughs> It all started with a special Thanksgiving church service held at Christ Embassy, Abakaliki, the Aboy State Capital, where the governor of the state, engineer David Umahi, kicked off the celebration of his 58th birthday. The governor is here, accompanied by members of the executive, legislative and judiciary council to celebrate this new age in his life. This is a celebration of so many achievements in his life. First, the attainment of this new age and his accomplishments as a two-time governor of the state, regarded as the salt of the nation. The moment came for him to dance forward in thanksgiving to God. The word of God is our direction. Through the word of God, you will walk in light. Through the word of God, you will walk in wisdom. As you celebrate 58 years today, many years ahead of you, because God has brought you to the place of agelessness in the name of Jesus Christ. As we spell J, E, E, S, S, U, U, and S. This concluded this first part of the celebration and the magnificent State Christian Ecumenical Center came alive, playing host to dignitaries from all over the country to celebrate with the governor. As they settled in, they make welcome the celebrant, engineer David Umahi, accompanied by the governor of Abia State, Okezie Ikbazu.
highly honored to stand here before you to make this opening remarks. When great men of accomplishments celebrate birthdays, it becomes a different ball game. It becomes a celebration of so many things at a time. Celebrating their wisdom, celebrating their character and personality with its uniqueness, celebrating their political philosophy and ideology, celebrating above all their accomplishments, which I should have mentioned here, but they are already listed in the paper you are having there. The event was a mixture of every other thing, including music, comedy, and dance. We are all survivors here. In fact, anybody living on planet Earth now, once they write your name, they should put XC behind, survive COVID. Because never in the history of mankind have we seen disease claim so much life. Anybody who sees his birthday and let the person celebrate, because we are lucky to be alive. Can, did we ever imagine that in our lifetime, a doctor, a security man will be checking the temperature of a doctor in front of a bank and he will be complied? This celebration for the governor is not just celebrating another year, but one with so many achievements recorded in the state, especially in the area of infrastructure development. Some of the guests hailed his performance in the last six years. Governor Mike, be not discouraged. Be not what? Discouraged. Continue the good work you are doing. Nibo are looking. Nibo are watching. Nigerians are observing. The world is looking. We wish you well. I have worked very closely with him. I have not seen a young man so dedicated, so committed, so intelligent, so he thought that The drink is ready as Governor of Abia State, Okezi Ikbazu, stepped up to the podium to propose the toast. We pray that he strives to remember his accomplishments will not waver and he will remain a shining light from the eastern parts of Nigeria to the rest of the world. I want us to shout big hip 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 I can hear my answer What about the world? Let's get together now this is time for the celebrant, Governor David Umahi, to cut his cake. An E, A, and a T. Thank you very much. Because you have no trouble, no one, no. Because you have no trouble. Dancing is one of the things the celebrants love to do, and his birthday presented an opportunity.
the governor seemed overwhelmed by the show of love. He stepped up the podium to give his speech, not after another brief dance. So thank you very, very much. Thank you, Deputy Governor. Thank you, Speaker. Thank you, NWC. Thank you, the Khan Chairman. Thank you, my Pastor. Thank you, all the Agon, the SSA local government. Thank you, my Chief of Staff. Thank you, my Lords, the Judges of Ebony State. Uh, let me assure that all the projects we have started, we will accomplish them. We will accomplish them. As engineer David Umahi tries to soak up all the love showered on him on this special day, he promised to continue to reciprocate by staying focused on his primary assignment, which is to continue to provide good governance to the people of Ebony State.